Warriors NRL Fanatics here back today with a video but before getting into it please make sure you don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below you're liking the video and you're sharing your thoughts in the comment section below but let's get in let's get into it now should the Warriors go after Shane Flanagan or Jeff Toovey as an assistant coach for the 2022 NRL season and you know my big thoughts are, yes, definitely, 100% for sure. I think we should. Now, Justin Morgan, now he's been around at the club for a long, long time as an assistant coach, and he's our defence coach this year. And honestly, I don't think our defence has improved with Justin Morgan as a, as a coach. Now, I don't think it has improved at all. You know, we still concede a lot of points. You know, we're not great defensively. We're not up there as one of the top defensive teams of the competition this year. And over the previous years. So, you know, Justin Morgan, he worked alongside Stephen Kearney as well. So, look, I think Justin Morgan, you know, look, he's done okay in the past. But I think, you know, the last couple of years, Justin Morgan hasn't really helped improve this team. So, personally for me, I think Justin Morgan needs to go. Bring in someone else, you know, bring in someone like a Shane Flanagan as an assistant coach. Bring in someone like a Jeff Toovey. Now, the Jeff Tuvian one might be out of the blue for you guys. It might be out of the blue sort of comment. But, you know, Jeff Tuvey, he's, you know, unemployed. He's unemployed. No, he hasn't got a head coaching job at the moment. So, you know, you know, I think he wouldn't be a bad option. And also Shane Flanagan. Look, I'm not the biggest fan of Shane Flanagan. But, you know, I think, you know, what he said last week, you know, in commentary when the Warriors were playing was spot on. His comments were spot on. He was 100%. He was 100% correct you know he's 100% correct what he said and Shane Flanagan you know he's won a premiership with the Sharks you know he's he's coached Sharks with a lot of final series as well so you know would it be the right option I don't know I really don't know but you know I think he's not not a bad choice he's not a bad choice you know to come in and help the club out and you know maybe help get the club to where it needs to be, you know, help help the Warriors out, you know, help Nathan Brown out, and I, I think, you know, Shane Flanagan's not, he's not a bad coach, but, you know, obviously he's not highly rated like Craig Bellamy or Wayne Bennett, but, you know, he's still, he's still, you know, he's won a premiership, you know, a premiership is, means something, you know, he's won a premiership with the Sharks, so, you know, I think Shane Flanagan, you know, wouldn't be a bad option, you know, Jeff Tuvey, I think we need some better assistance around Nathan Brown personally, in my opinion. So, you know, people might say, you know, Nathan Brown should get the sack and bring someone else in to head coach. But, you know, it's been only one year. Why should we sack Nathan Brown after one year? I don't I don't agree with some of the comments around that sacking Nathan Brown yet. So, you know, if the Warriors want to do well next year, I believe they need some better assistant coaches around Nathan Brown, you know, to help Nathan Brown, you know, out a bit more. Take the pressure off Nathan Brown. But yeah, that's my uh, thoughts on it. But let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And if you're new to the channel, please don't forget to subscribe. And also, if you're a returning viewer, make sure you're liking the video and you're commenting your thoughts down in the comment section below. And also, before I go, I did a chat with Hold the Ball on his channel last night and with... Nick from Australia. So if you haven't seen that got, got one already, please make sure you don't go back on Hold the Bulls channel and check it out where we chatted all things Warriors last night. So go check that out on Hold the Bulls channel as well. So yeah, thanks guys for watching and I'll see you all in the next one.